Welcome to the family. I am Coach Gabby and we are all so stoked to have you. Now I know it's taking a little bit longer given the times that we're in for Tonal to show up and so I created Box and Burn for you, a workout that requires zero equipment to get that body moving as soon as possible. Now this workout was designed to challenge and strengthen you mentally, emotionally, and physically. No better way than to utilize this workout to prepare you for when this bad boy shows up so you are locked and ready to go. Now rest assured that once you do receive your tonal, there's going to be hundreds of different programs and workouts from a variety of coaches to keep you busy and keep you on track. I hope you enjoy. What up tonal fam? It's Coach Gabby here and I want to first welcome you to my home. Yes, we are all in the same position here with this safe at home policy and although it feels safe at home, you may be experiencing a little bit of what I'm experiencing, which is some pent up energy. And so we thought for you, why not continue to bring you content and be in that same space and provide you what it is that I know I need while I'm this time and perhaps you guys need as well. And so I'm so excited to share this class with you as it's a cardio boxing class. Now, Tonal is a strength training machine, and that is why we love Tonal, right? This is going to be an offset to complement all of your programs, any other workout with a straight cardio, high-intensity style class. Everything today is going to be done off of Tonal, and all you're going to need is your mat in that body. Now, the focus is going to be the heart rate. So make sure you have a towel and some water nearby, and stay connected to that heart rate the entire way through. I'll be your reminder to keep you there. Now, the second thing I want you to focus on is that mind. Boxing challenges the mind. So when I say we are literally going to flex that brain, we are literally about to flex that brain. Now, listen, team, I want you to turn that music all the way up. Get that beat bumping nice and strong. And then as you step away from tonal, I want you to create some space in your area and give me a wide stance. Let's get right into this now. Nice wide stance, giving me a big shoulder rotation back and away. If you've rolled with me before, I like to start with these pretty much always. I like to release that neckline and find the center of the being while rooting those heels. Giving me swimmer arm, straight arm right, then left. Going right, then left. Good. Try to eliminate any other rocking in that body. And find the breath work here. Body is going to be moving at one tempo the entire way through. But I need that breath work lengthening. Lasting a little bit longer. Torso twists. Twisting one way, then the other. Now in boxing, we call these arms on guard. Elbows up. Thumbs right on either side of those temples. And the core is nice and tight. This is about to be a 30, 35 minute workout for those abs. Reach the arm now. Reach. Press. Good. So it's a big extension all the way through. Feel that lat muscle stretch away from that spine. Similar motion you're gonna be giving me on your ones and twos. We'll talk about those later. Up to the corner here. Swinging up and switch. Big extension. Pressing down in the ball of the foot. Feel the stretch through the entire side body. Come on, push. Reach. We're gonna go middle finger down to the toe. Curl that spine. Let's go. Come on, down. Reach. Good. Curling the knee and rounding the spine. Big extension down to the floor. Giving me eight. Six. Good. Deep squat in the center. Three, two, one. Let's go. Deep squat. Press push. Down. Find the breath work. Root the body. Root the mind. Let's go. Down. Aha. It's going to be full body today, baby. Giving me a pulse at the bottom. Three, two, one. Big pulse. Push. Arms can come out and away. You can bring them to prayer. Widen those knees. Draw back in those heels. Giving me eight. Good. Six. Now you're going to give me a hook. Jump in, jump out. Follow me. Three, two. Let's go. Hook. Jump in, jump out. Hush. Jump in, jump out. Elbow goes up. Fist for the hand. Come on. 
in, inner thighs, outer thighs, push. Find that rhythm, stay consistent. Turn your hooks into uppercuts, go. Push, jump in, jump out, push. Right up the jawline. Good breathing. Four more. Ha. Exhale on your punch. Ha. Come on. Push. Good. Jumping jacks. Let's go. Push. Breath work, baby. I'm going to be challenged at heart rate the entire way through. Got to work. Eight. Come on. Six. Low squat, fast feet. Light these thighs on fire. Come on. Push. You keep going, don't stop. Can you sit a little bit lower? Are you in an apartment? Wake that neighbor up below you. Sit lower. Eight seconds. Eight. Come on. Six. Good. For four. Three. Butt kicks. Right heel to the right glute. Go. Push. Use this to bring that heart rate down a little bit. Stretch those quads. Push. That's it. Eight seconds. Eight, six, for four, three, two, and one, baby. Good. That body is warm. It's ready to go. Now it's time to get into this boxing. So I'm going to draw you into your first stance first, okay? Nice and easy. I want you to connect your back heel to your front toe. As I mentioned, we will be doing both sides, so don't worry about which side you do first. Big inhale, big exhale. That one was for me. So back heel to the front toe, slightly wider than hip width apart. So imagine there's this line and you're splitting that line between that front toe and that back heel. Nice and balanced. Now you're always gonna be able to weight shift front and back and stay pretty neutral, light on the feet. Your lead arm are gonna be your odd punches, one, three, five. Your rear arm are gonna be your even punches, two, four, six. What? I got you, I'm about to teach you. So shoulders down, arms are on guard. Remember that stance, chin down, protect the money maker. Now your lead punch is your one. As you extend, push into the ball of the leg, bring that shoulder right by the chin, eyes down, eyes on the opponent, and go ahead and twist, pinky to the sky. Giving me a one, one, push, one, push, one. Good, one more and hold, good. Now from here, your two team. I need you to weight shift forward and completely rotate, pinky to the sky, hip, knee, toe, all comes to tunnel towards me. Giving me a two, push, two, push, two, push, next one, hold. Good, now your three is your lead hook. Protect the face. All I need you to do is cock that elbow out, Big weight shift back in that body. Giving me a three. Ha! Three. Ha! Three. Ha! One more. Hold. Relax the neck. Don't let your punches come from your neck. Come from the power in the trunk. We'll keep talking about that. Four is your rear hook. Protect face. Weight shifts forward. Elbow comes up. Knock them out with that rear hook, baby. Giving me a four. Go four. Ha! Four. Push. Four. One more. Ha! Good. Now your five is that lead uppercut. You slip, get low and underneath that jawline, right by that belt line, give them a nice uppercut. You're gonna follow your chin, press down in the ball of the foot, activate that glute. Giving me a five, down, ha, five, down, ha, five, five. One more hold, ha, good. Now your six is your rear. Now for your slip, slip in a neutral space and rotate forward on the actual punch. Give me a six. Ha, six, ha, six. Push, one more. Ha, good, you guys. Now let's talk about those slips. Slips are your defensive move. You're dodging their one, and then you're dodging their two arms on guard. So, slip, 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 slip. Just enough to come off that center line. Use these to transition to the opposite side. Uh-huh. Good. All right, settle in. So same thing, right? Front heel, back toe, wider than hip width apart, shoulders down. I mentioned not to punch from your shoulders. Don't create tension in the neckline. Power comes from the bottom half of the body, believe it or not, in the core. As soon as you extend that punch, it retracts. It comes right back, giving me that lead one. Go, push, one, push, 
One, one, next one, hold. Good, weight should be in that front foot. You're gonna switch now here, rotating through for that two, raising that back heel. Two, ha, two, ha, two, ha. Next one, hold. Good, three, lead hook, baby. Big sweep, back and away, let's go. Three, ha, three, three. One more, ha, four, let's go. Back, big and strong, give it to me. Exhale on the punch. Hold, good, five, lead uppercut, slip, get down below the belt line. Give it to him nice and strong, right up that jawline, go. Down, five, down, again, again, good, six, neutral on the slip, rotate on the actual punch itself, let's go. Again, push again, one more, good, slip baby, slip, 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 three, two, and one. All right, you know your punches, you've got your ones and twos, those are straight, your threes and fours, those are big hooks, your fives and sixes baby, right up that jawline. Let's have some fun with it. We're gonna put those punches together a little bit now. So we're gonna start with a simple B, and we're gonna stay together tempo-wise. Now if that's not really your job, your jam, feel free to work on your own tempo, okay? So let's start with a one, two, connecting those first. Follow my B, in three, in two, in one, arms on guard, goes one, two, set, one, two. Good, push, 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 push. Four more at this. Tempo. And then we're gonna do what I call exploding the punch. Exploding here goes. One, two, set. Ha, ha. Good, hit. Ha, ha. Again, ha, ha. Giving you another view. Ha, ha. Chin down. Ha, ha. Good, one, two, three, four, slow. Let's go. Three, four. Three, four. Three, four, elbows up. Four more. Three, four, chin down, ha, ha. We gotta explode, baby. Go to work right here, come on. Three, four, set, ha, ha. Use the legs, ha, ha. Come on, yeah, push, push. Come on, ha, ha, two more, ha, ha. Fives and sixes slow, let's go. Five, six, five, six, five, six. Say the numbers in your head, team. It's gonna help that mind-body connection. Ha, ha, core tight. Explode, baby. In three, two, one. Come on, five, six, set. Ha, 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 ha. Yep, ha, ha. Come on, four, three. Yes, two. Good, jump rope break, let's go. Come on, push. What is going on, baby? You're boxing, that's what's going on. Eight seconds, eight. Start to transition to that opposite high. Back heel to that front toe, settle in. Give me one in, two, let's go. One, two, one, two. Find a spot on the screen. Lucky me, that'll probably be some part of my body where you're keeping your eye on that prize and you're knocking it out, right? Explode, let's go, come on. Settle. <laughs> Exhale on the punch. It's gonna give you more power. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> what do you want? What are you fighting for? Three, four, slow. Let's go. Three, four. <laughs> twist, twist, trunk. <laughs> Chin down, relax the neck though. Three more. <laughs> Say the numbers. Three, four. Good. Explode, let's go. Come on, sa sa. Sa sa. Sa sa. Get out of the box. Push, push. Get out of the box. Hoo, hoo. Come on. Ha, ha. Yeah. Ha, ha. Fives and sixes. Slow. Hoo, hoo. Ha, ha. Let's go. Push, push. Come on. Five, six. Five, six. Good. Five, six. Double it up, explode, baby. Right here, come on. Shoo, shoo. Roll the shoulders back, back, back. Come on. Yeah. Let's go. Come on. 
Yes. Good. Jump rope. Come on, baby. Bring it down. I hope you're having fun. I hope that music is bumping, baby. That's what it's all about. We're gonna release those toxins. We're gonna sweat out of the body, burning those calories. And most of all, we're gonna release any stagnant, any pent up energy. A release not only physically, but mentally and emotionally as well today. Two and one, amazing job. I'm gonna give you a second, take a quick sip of water. Remember this is a cardio class, so make sure you don't chug that water, breathe. Good. You may be able to see my pup. She's taking a nice little nap watching her mom kick her own butt. Hopefully she stays quiet for us the rest of the time. Good. We're going to go into a combo now. You're ready for it. I'm about to build, you're about to build an eight-piece combo here, yes? We're going to do it slow, similar to how we just built those punches one after the other. Now our combo today is one, two, three, two, slip two, slip four. You're gonna do this by the end of it. Find that stance, baby. Lead arm is slightly in front, chin is down. We're gonna find that same rhythm. Start with a one, two. Let's go. One, two. One, two. Good. Feel the, te feel the technique. That back leg, it's like you're squashing a bug in it with that twist. Add the three. One, two, three. Right here. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Core, baby. Boxing is so core-centric. And this is going to help us with our strength training. Give me that two now. Add it on. Let's go. One, two, three, two. One, two, three, two. Yes, you can. Four more. Sam. One, two, three, two. One, two, three, two. Now slip two, go, slip two, slip two, away back in, sucker punch, back push, slip two, slip two. Now give me a slip four, right here, go, slip four, rear hook, slip four, slip four, come on baby, ha, release, let go. If you're pissed off about something, get it out now. Slip two, slip four. Slip two, four. Two, four. Straight. Hook. Straight. Hook. Come on. Three more. Hoo. Ha. Hoo. Ha. Whole combo. Slow. One, two, three, two. Slip, two, slip. Another view. Keep going. One, Two, three, two, slip, two, slip, tempo. Come on. One, two, three, two, slip, two, four. One, two, three, two, slip, two, four. Come on, baby. Yes, you can. Let's go. One, two, three, two, slip, two, four. Boxers bounce here, nice and easy. Chin down. Shake and relax those arms. We're going to the other side. That is an eight punch combo. We're about to tack that on the other side. Give me a one, two. Let's go. One, two. Now boxing is all about the weight shift, yeah? On that two, come forward. That's your power. All the power from that back leg. Come on. Adding a three right here. Let's go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Chin down, don't turn away. Eyes on the opponent the entire time. Ha. Ha. Add a two to that at the end. One, two, three, two. One, two, three, two. Ha, ha. Ha, ha. Push. Let's go. Straight, straight, hook, straight. Give me a slip two. Let's go. Slip two, set. Slip two, chill. Hoom, ha. Get out of there, get in there. Get out of there, get in there. Come on. Hoom, ha. Hoom, ha. Slip four, hook. Slip, hoom. Slip, elbow out. Don't wind up for your hook, but just cut 
the elbow out. Strong. Come on. Whew. Good. Whew. All together, slow. One, two, three, two, slip, two, slip, four. Again, one, three, two. Ha. Let's go, baby. Tempo. One, two, three, two, slip. Ha. Four, one, two, three, two, slip. Push. Ha. Come on. Ha. Say it in the head. Two, four, one, two, three, two, slip, two, two more. Hoo, hoo. Ha, 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 one more. Yeah. Boxers bounce, bounce. Relax that neck. Catch that breath for three. Come on, two, and one. Recover rest. I hope you're sweating. I know I am. Energy is high, baby. Keep it up. Keep it all the way up. Look, it's just as difficult for me as it is for you to try to get cardio done in the house. I mean, if I'm being completely honest, I don't really like doing cardio at all. That's the answer to me. Running or biking, it's too repetitive for me personally. So that's why I picked up boxing. A beautiful opportunity to get a good cardio workout in while still challenging the mind, right? Connecting the mind and the body, learning these sequences, different technique. I'm all about that. All right, we're going to pop into the lower half of the body. Now, the stance is going to be similar here, team. These are called a knee chamber. A couple things to know. Your back heel is going to be facing where you're kicking your opponent. Now, the leg that you are working on a chamber, you're going to bring the toe back. Think heel towards your glute a point of that toe. So from your shin through that ankle bone, it's a smooth line, yeah? No bend in that ankle. The other thing, you need your knee in line with your hip the entire way through, okay? So you're gonna give me three levels, low, medium, high. Now the way you leverage more height on that last one is by letting the upper half of the body dip back a little bit. How high does not matter? Flexing that glute, rooting that standing leg, utilizing your core is what matters. These will eventually go into a full kick. We're gonna kinda of have a rhythm to it again. Follow me, have fun with it. Here we go, first side, getting that heel towards the opponent, arms on guard. Remember, knee in line with that hip, let's work this lower half of the body. So giving me one level, two level, three levels, down. Ha, 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 good, come on, ha, ha. Push, push, push. Four more. Keep going. You stay in the same place. I'm just giving you different angles. Three. Good. Two. Push. Now turn these into full kicks. Straight, straight, straight. Come on. Straight, straight, straight. That's it. Whoom, whoom, whoom. Keep going. Stay where you are. Four more. Ha, ha. Ha, come on, three, two, one. Come on, two more. Yes, one more. Low, medium, high. Good, now give me a full roundhouse kick right here. Go roundhouse, roundhouse. So at the highest mark, push, push. Come on, four, three, ones and twos, nice and quick, go. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. As soon as you punch, you retract. Not those fists. Feel the twist in the body. Eight more seconds, switching sides. Eight, come on. Six, let's go. Four, three, two, and one. Second side, heel to the toe, low, medium, high. Use the oblique, use the glute. Let's go in three, two, one, come on. Low, medium, high. Low, medium, high. Push, push, push. Pull that knee back. Keep working. Low, medium, high. Ha, ha, ha. One more, four. Yes. Up, full kicks. Straight, straight, push. Come on. Ha, ha, ha. Ha, ha, ha. Core's working. Glutes are burning, baby. I know, come on. That's it. Push, push, push. Come on. Push. Push, push, one more. Full roundhouse.
arms kicks. Let's go. Round house. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Ones and twos, baby. Let's go. Come on. One, two, one, two. Breathing. Let's go. One, two, one, two. Eight seconds. If you can, yes, you will. Let's go. Push. Make that body sweat. Make that body work. Four more seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Yeah, baby. Amazing. So you now know six different punches on either side. You know one defensive move. That is your slip, your dodge of the one, dodge of the two. You now know what a knee chamber is, and you would use that to block. And you now know what a roundhouse kick is. And that's what you're gonna use to knock them out, right? A little bit of water, wipe yourselves down, catch your breath, baby. Now this is one of my favorite sections of this class. I call it, call the shot. I'm gonna call a shot riffing off the tip of my mind. You're gonna deliver that shot in real time. So although most of this class thus far has been tempo based a little bit, right? Now we're gonna get away from that tempo, I call the shot. You explode that motion, whatever motion it is. Amazing for the mind, really good for that body. So let's explore, let's have fun. Don't feel defeated. If this is your first time boxing and you're like, what the heck is going on? Come back, take this class again, take it again, again. Things will start to settle, things will start to sit in. And every time I come back, I'm gonna slightly shift this so we're learning new combos and new movements. Fall into that first stance, baby. Come on. Breathe. Good. So settle in. You got to be quick. Light on the toes. Rooted when you punch. Give me a one. Ha. One. Ha. One. Ha. One, two. Ha. Ha. One, two. Ha. Ha. Do you hear me breathing? I need those exhales. One, two. One, two. Good. Three. Ha. Three. Ha. Three. Ha. One, two. Slip. Ha. Ha. Again. Choo, choo, ha. Again. Choo, choo, ha. Good. One, two, slip two. Ha, ha, ha. Again, go. Choo, choo, ha. Again. Ha. Again. Ha. Again. Choo, choo. Ha. Good. Slips. Slip. 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 Fives and sixes non-stop. Fives and sixes. Roll those shoulders back. Down in those feet. Use this to get to the other side. Breathe. Good. Settle in. I call. Give me a one. You're on that other side. One. One. Again. Again. One, two, baby. Go. Good. Go. Now don't linger in there for that two. They can get you. Get out of there right away. One, two. Get out. Again. Go. Add the three. One, two, three. Yeah, go. Shoo, shoo, ha. Again. Shoo, shoo, ha. Three. Ha. Three. Ha. Three. Ha. One, two, three. Ha, ha, ha. Good. One, two, slip. Hoo, hoo, ha. Again. Hoo, hoo, ha. Go. Sa, sa. Again. Sa, sa. One, two, slip two. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Ha. Don't worry about my speed work at yours. Breathe. One, two, slip two. Go. Again. One more. Non stops. Fives and sixes. Go, baby. Roll those shoulders back. Pedal in those feet. Squeeze your core. Chain down. Eight seconds. Eight. Come on. Six. Four, four. Three. Two. And one. Yes. Away. All right, baby. The boxing is done for today. I got a little strength, high intensity series for you. It'll be five minutes, five moves, work for 40, rest for 20. I got a little bit of abs, and then we call it, baby. And then we call it. Drink some water in this transition. In this transition is when you will also be grabbing your mat. If that music isn't loud enough, turn it up. You got a little bit of a strength set for you, like I said, right? 40 seconds working, 20 seconds rest. Music up, baby, if you need it. Catch your breath, deep inhales. All right, so line that mat down, all the way, perfect, Woo. all right, we got about 30 seconds until we start, let's
let's do a little breath work exercise and reset that mind, reset that body. Deep inhale from below the belly button, go, inhale. Chest, throat, exhale, all that oxygen out. Again, inhale. Exhale. One more, deepest one, yeah, inhale. Exhale. In 10 seconds, we are on that clock. I need 40 seconds of a body weight squat here, yeah? Here we go, and two and one, come on. Squat and push. Now you can work at whatever tempo is right for you. If it's faster, go baby. If it's slower, there's success in that baby. You know, sometimes we get things a little twisted in the mind. We think the faster, the harder. That's not always the case. By slowing things down, you're gonna force that body to work with the proper technique. You're gonna be able to mentally connect to that body and feel. Am I flexing in the right spaces? 10 seconds, let's go. Come on, push. That's it, damn, press push. Give me two more. Yes, go, one more. Down and breathe. That's a 20 second rest, baby, how we doing? Now listen, while you rest, I'm gonna show you. I need a jack, punch, jack, punch. Yeah, slight shift of that body, working those obliques. We're on in five seconds. A little bit of a cardio push here. Here we go, in two and one, come on, push and twist, jack, punch, jack, punch. Let's go, let's go. If my tempo is working for you, stay with me. Use me as motivation. If that beat's got you at another tempo, ride that beat, baby. The dancer in me loves that. Come on, Gotta raise, the focus was that heart rate. I'm here challenging you. You're here. Keeping all the dots connected. Let's go, five seconds. Whoosh, ha, whoosh, ha, one more each side. Ha, one more, ha, 20 second rest, baby. Woo, breathing. Oh, Lord. I love it, I love it, I love it. I'm able to check off my cardio workout for the day here with you all. Now listen, the next motion is a kneeling get up. 20 seconds on one side, and then we'll switch to that opposite side. We're on the clock, let's go. Down, down, up, up. Stay on that same side. Push, down, down, step. As you step, press out of that lead glute. Come on, down, down, push. Good, switching sides, down, 20 seconds. Up, up, down, up, up, down. Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Give me two more. Damn. Give me one more. Push. Damn. Damn. Ha. Ha. Yeah, baby. Good. I'm going to rest those legs on this next set. Take a seat. Catch your breath. We have some tricep dips, yeah? We acknowledge that we've been working the bottom half of the body. A focus there. Of course, upper body with some punches. But let's train, train this upper body. Fingertips towards the glutes. Heels nice and tight. If you got bad wrists, pop up to those knuckles. You're on the clock. Let's go. Down. Push. 40 seconds. I'm going to work at this tempo. If you want to slow it down, go for it. I feel good. I can feel all the energy releasing out of me. Any stress, any fear, any worry, any tightness, setting that free. Go. Push. That's it. Five seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Triceps on fire. One of the weaker parts of the body. So stay focused on those moments when you know you're breaking that muscle down. That's the important part. Stay focused. Stay connected to that. First process. First part of the process is breaking down the muscle that exists. I'm gonna hit you with some push-ups. This is your last move, team. Let's. Go, baby, you're on the clock right here. Come on, down, press, push. Down, press, push. You keep going, do not stop. Give me those push-ups. If you need to take your knees, take your knees. Where is your mind, what do you want? You've got 25 seconds. The answer is yes, and the time is right now. 
Push the floor away from you. Utilize the strength from the ground beneath you to execute these motions. 10 seconds, maybe it's three more, baby. Come on, three, press, push, two, press, push, one more. Yeah, throw that talent, stay close to the ground. We're gonna end with some abdominals and then I'm gonna cool you down and get you out of here. Take a moment first, breathe. <sighs> no rush here, feel in control feel rooted. There's nothing worse than spastic energy, right? Now I'm going to focus on the core because quite frankly, that's what I love to do. I love ending my classes with some abdominals. It's the center of the body. It's the most important part of the body. Yes. All right. Flat on that back all the way down. Now you know how to do that sit up. I need the elbows wide. I need the head resting in those hands. Chin is high to the sky. We're going to start slow. We're going to work with the tempo here. Three, two, one, contract. Forward abdominal crunch. Pull. Pull. And squeeze. Let's go. Up. Shh. Next one, hold at the top. Hold. Now pulse. Pulse. That's it. Push. Eight seconds, keeping the blades off the ground, pulling the belly button into the spine. That's it. Side to side, opposite elbow, opposite knee. Slow, pull, release, pull. Uh-huh, squeeze. Keep the neck neutral. Hit the oblique, switch to the opposite side. You know we gotta go double time, baby. Give me that pulse, side to side. Let's work, pulse, pulse. Lift that blade, peel the back off of the ground. Come on, eight, six, legs in a tabletop position, flex those feet. In the center, pulse. Now can you flex those low abdominals a little bit more below the belly button? Eight seconds, eight, six, good. Rest the head flat, giving me a leg raise right here. Coming down, two, three, four and up two a range of motion that works for you down two three four and up slow and controlled let's go down two three four and up breathing baby come on down two three four as you come up stop halfway hands behind the head raise the chest flutter kicks kick kick Belly button in, push. Yeah, there's that burn, baby. Eight seconds, come on. Eight, let's go. Six, I want your feet planted, going for those heels. Heel taps, let's go. Reaching one side and the other. Tap, 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 tap. Last eight seconds. Six seconds for four, three, two, and one. Oh my goodness, hands above the head, legs long. Let yourself sink into the ground. Feel the flex in the core. Get stoked about the results that are to come, yes? Right now, bring your open palms down by your hips. Roll the shoulders back. Maybe it's a retuck of that tail and then a relengthen of those legs. I want you to lightly close your eyes, and I understand that this might be hard for some of you, yes? Well, with those eyes closed, and it's okay if there's some energy in those eyelids, a little bit of a flutter, open the palms to the sky, let your shoulders relax, let your legs fall open. Relax your jaw. Deep inhale and go. Inhale. Exhale. Again, inhale. Exhale, one more inhale, exhale, allow yourself to feel the new space in that body from all of that release that you've created, from anything that was not serving you before you started this class. I want you to hug both knees into the chest when you're ready. 
And it could be a slight rock side to side or small circles, whatever's right for you. These cool downs are just a template. I want you to be honest and in tune with your body and respond to what it's asking you for. I want you to take one heel over the opposite knee in a figure four stretch and hug that hamstring into the chest, flexing both feet. A nice hip opener from that chamber series you gave to me. Good, we're gonna switch opposite leg, opposite knee, turn and hug, both feet flex, heels in line with those knees. Breathe. Oh, there's Bia. That's it. Good, now we're gonna come all the way up and I'm gonna put us in a runner's lunge. We're gonna open up those hips a little bit, that hip flexor. Get there however is easiest for you, no right or wrong way. And once you're there, big stretch in that back heel, opening up that hip flexor and turn releasing that low back. Good baby, switch, opposite side, nice and easy. Chest lifts, flexing that back heel, energy is strong. Good, now I'm gonna take us to the center, just face me. Toes can be turned out, they can be neutral, whatever's right for you, and just maybe a little sway side to side. Open up those hips. Now we're gonna extend these legs straight. Eyes are gonna go to the back of your room, let the crown of the head fall to the floor. Big deep stretch here. Yes, let your spine lengthen. Let all the energy draw out of the crown of the head and sink in to the ground beneath you. Bending those knees, rolling up one little vertebrae at a time. Shoulders back. Now, before I let you go, I do want to stretch these arms really quick, taking one arm across that chest. Big lat stretch, shoulder down and away. Breathe. That's it, baby. Legs together. Bring the arm behind the head, grab the elbow. Bring those ribs in and stretch. And if it feels right, maybe you send that hip to the side a little bit. We raised that heart rate. You got that sweat. You released that energy. A job well done and a lot to be taken away. Be proud of yourself. Rolling down and away. Breathe. Good. All right, behind that head, nice and easy. Front ribs in, side stretch. Good, and come out, shake it out, maybe a couple shoulder rotations. Team, you did it, baby. Now remember, this is a great workout to tap into your programs on a day off or whatever the case may be. Here's a cardio option for you to not only get that sweat, but to release that energy mentally and emotionally as well. We are all here with you, team. We are all going through that same thing. And quite frankly, anyone and everyone who's done this workout felt what you just felt. I know I did. So I commend you for showing up. I commend you for getting that cardio in, in the space of your home. And I can't wait to see you next time. One more big inhale and take all this energy with you. Inhale. Exhale, seal the deal. I'm Coach Gabby. Check out my high intensity classes and check out all our other coaches. Everybody's stellar. I'll see you next time.